yes the crab has got out again I actually put a tea towel over the slight free end of the tank last night weighted it down with some ornaments this morning we found him hanging upside down there so of course I didn't want to put it back in in case it caused him to fall I've just gone to find his dinner crab cuisine because I knew I had a fresh unopened pack turned round to find him on the floor right next to my foot so he seems to like me because he seems to follow me around quite a bit he's climbed back on top of the tank when it had the lid on he's got back down got inside one of Andy's birthday cards and now he's just walking round and round and round his tank so I'm going to pick him up in a minute and put him back in um, we've decided to call him Harry H-A-R-I spelling not because of Houdini, although it does seem to match him quite well now, seeing as he's got out twice in two days. But actually because um, the actual meaning behind the name is like tan, brown, orange, red, yellow, like autumnal colours basically, and obviously that's what he is. So I I've decided to go for that, I think it's quite a cheeky name for a male. Yeah, I know it looks like this table needs a wash, but it's actually um, water staining. I just got it from a neighbour that were moving out, which were quite kind. Because I didn't have a stand for this tank before. So there's a look at him climbing around. Don't think he were going to fall in. That actually is the way they throw the cell phone corners. It's quite spider-like, really, the way he uses his legs to hold on so much. It is quite rare that they fall. He's just climbing on some picture frames at the moment. They're waiting to be hung. But he can quite easily climb back up on top from there. So I just thought I'd let you have an, another look at him escaping. And doing very well, settling in very well. And the fact that he's now named.